History buffs will tell you the California gold rush reshaped America in the mid-19th century, but science says the real gold explosion occurred long before that, according to a new study. Two stars crashed together 130 million light years away, and the impact was so hard it sent huge amounts of precious metals like gold and platinum flying through the universe. Here to explain, theoretical physicist Dr. Michio Kaku. Welcome back, Dr. Kaku. Glad to be on the show. So this is where we got gold. That's right. There's a cosmic mystery. Was where does gold come from? Gold yeah. at Fort Knox. Gold in your wedding band. You see, the elements of our body were cooked in stars. We are literally made of stardust. But the higher elements, like platinum, gold, the sun is not hot enough to create the higher elements. So that was a mystery. Where does gold come from? Not from the stars. Now we know from the gravity wave detector. It comes from the collision of two neutron stars. Yes. Neutron and these are stars, small dead stars. Right? Small dead stars are like black hole wannabes. If they were bigger, they would turn into a black hole. Okay. But they're too small. And when they collide, that provides the energy necessary to cook the higher elements like platinum and gold. And it just flung throughout the universe right into my gold backed IRA. That's right. The amount of gold that came out of it was equivalent to 10 Earths. Think of wow. 10 Earths made out of gold. That's how much energy came out of there. Where can we find more of it? Uh, well, <laughs> you'd have to find more uh, California gold rushes in order to find more gold. But the Are there other planets with, with big gold and platinum supplies? Uh, it's Start conceivable. A jewelry store, so. It's conceivable, right? Now remember, this is one of the first big discoveries from our gravity wave telescope. Remember the Nobel Prize was given just last month to three physicists who created a new kind of telescope, a gravity wave telescope. Wow. This is one of the first discoveries from that telescope. Now, we have light telescopes that were given to us by Galileo, radio telescopes that can see galaxies, mm -hmm. but now with gravity wave telescopes, we can see the interiors of black holes, neutron wow. stars, maybe even the origin of the universe itself. The ultimate question, which shall be answered soon, and now we know where gold came from, and it wasn't the jewelry store on 47th Street. Dr. Michio Kaku, thank you for being here. Glad to be on. You're always golden in my eye. My golden eye.